Alright guys, so I was editing this video and I realized that I did not have an intro. So this is my intro. I got cryotherapy and I'm going to take you guys along for the ride. So you'll see a few random clips before then, but then you'll see my cryotherapy experience. So I hope that you enjoy. so you just saw me get cryotherapy um in my personal opinion one session totally worth it it was 45 dollars for an intro session which is basically like what their price would be on like groupon it's just a first time price of 45 dollars but after that it goes up to like 75 per session and to me that's not worth it um i do feel a lot better i'll be honest my core and my back were really really sore before going into it and Honestly, like an hour later, I did not have that soreness anymore and it could have been a coincidence But I'd like to think not because soreness doesn't usually tend to go away throughout the day It goes away overnight. So if anything like if I woke up this morning feeling better, it's like well, you could just be not sore anymore so To me it would definitely try it one time um, I'm someone that like with something like that. I would probably would have always wondered, you know, how would I feel if I did this? Would it work? Would I want to do it every single day? Would I want to do it once a week, once a month, whatever? I would always wonder. So I'm always willing to give something like that a try. And I will be honest, it was cold. It was really freaking cold. It didn't feel any colder than like just standing outside in the winter naked. I mean, you could do that for two minutes. It's not fun, but it definitely doesn't, it doesn't feel like negative 220 degrees. So it doesn't feel as cold as what it is, but it definitely does feel cold, but it's manageable. And so I'm not the expert on it, and i not the scientist nor the doctor, but basically what happens is that the frigid, cold, like nitrogen, frozen, dry air thing tricks your body into thinking that it's in danger. So what happens is all the blood rushes to your stomach, and when this happens, it boosts your metabolism. Um, apparently, it burns like 500 to 800 calories when you're in there because your body has to work so so hard to get its temperature back up to normal um to keep you alive i want to say so yeah you burn a crap ton of calories which is really funny because i was incredibly hungry yesterday especially after i did this when all the blood rushes to your stomach during it that's supposed to help boost your metabolism and then when you get out all the blood rushes back to the rest of your body. It's supposed to boost your immunity, um, boost your cell renewal, and just have a very like rejuvenating effect on you. There are people who claim skin benefits from it and other health benefits. For me, it was all about muscle soreness, and it has a similar effect on your body as taking an ice bath, but it's more tolerable than taking an ice bath, so 
it's also a lot easier. It's, you know, two or three minutes versus however long you're sitting in an ice bath for. But anyway, I digress. I think it's worth it to try at least once. I love trying stuff like that. I think it's so cool. Um, I know people do it on their face, and I'd be really interested in seeing, like, what that feels like. Um, but when I was in there, I had to be really careful to, like, make sure to keep my to keep my head up because I was getting a lot of the nitrogen, like, it was, at, like, right here. So I had to try really hard to make sure I wasn't breathing it in because every time I drop my head a little bit, I kind of start to feel a little woozy, so... Just a tip, when you're doing it, make sure that your head is like, your mouth is totally out of it if you try it. So anyway, that's gonna go ahead and wrap up this video. I hope that you liked seeing my experience. I'm a bit of a ham with things like that. So you'll see me be a little, or you saw me be a little goofy in the clip. But anyway, um, yeah, so that wraps up this video. Please like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. And comment down below if you would ever do this. Okay. Bye, guys.